So, who do you guys think is going to be the next crossover champion or person or faction or whatever you want to call it? Who do you think else is coming to raid? A while ago, I saw another post on Reddit talking about how the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles could be a pretty good crossover event for them to come into raid. I thought that was pretty cool too. I think Polarium actually came out with this on their Facebook page asking to name your dream crossover champion. So this is something that Polarium is considering. Who is the next crossover champion that they're going to bring into raid? Well, in the past we've had somebody like uh, Xena, we've had Rhonda, we've had Ninja, um, we've had uh, Simple who became Alex or something like that in Raid. Dark Souls, I think this would be a pretty cool crossover event. It would also fit the theme, I think. Havel the Rock, ooh. Or Sigmire of Katarina would be really cool champs. Solera as a fusion champ would be huge. Praise the fucking sun. Ninja Turtles as Lizardmen would be pretty good. Super dope. Or a Skinwalker. Turtles aren't lizards. Reptiles, close enough. I mean, they added Krisk, so why can't we have a Turtle Boy in there too? That's true. Chris, Turtle Boy, that's true. Fair point. I wouldn't complain as long as we get TMNT stuff. Master Splinter would fit right in with the skin rocker, uh, walkers, skin rockers. Shredder with the Shadowkin. Casey Jones would make a cool barbarian, that's true too. Ash from the Evil Dead, that would be pretty sick, but I don't really see how he would fit. I mean, he's got a gun. Are there, is there anybody with guns? Oh no, I, there's that one dwarf. There's that one dwarf that has a gun, Dilgul. But yeah, that would be pretty cool. So much this. I'd be keen for this Ash or Ash Ketchum. Leather Proposal 811 says Mayan, Aztec mythology, Greek, Egyptian. Honestly, I would be kind of hyped to see Xenomorphs from Aliens in the, in the game. That would be pretty huge. Or the Berserk anime or manga would be a fantastic choice as well. Guts would be a mythical badass, true. Or even a Lego. Griffith as a mythical would be dope too. Oh, Guts in the game would be a must pull for me, exactly. If they put Guts in the game, you best believe I'm spending money for that. It would be awesome. And without the armor and Greek mythology, it would be sick. Collab with Berserker. Guts in the game with Berserker gear. Nosferatu Zod as a mythical champion. Give us a doggo. Exactly. Where the hell is Packmaster's dog? Where's our dog? We're not living this down. We're not forgetting about this. Where the heck is the dog? Pretty sure you mean Paw Patrol. I thought that was pretty funny. Warhammer Fantasy Battle, Carl Fonz and Grimgol, please. Uh, summon the Elector Counts. A collab with Raid Chef. What? Naruto, Dragon Ball Z or One Piece or any kind of anime that fits the theme. Goku's power is on another level. Dude, I don't think... I mean, what do you think? Do you think Palerium could afford Goku? <laughs> do you think they could afford the Dragon Ball Z cast? That would be really expensive. Trunda's not Goku? Dude, Goku would have to go ham. Imagine a Kamehameha wave. Absolutely nothing to do with fantasy, but Eddie, the Iron Maiden's mascot. Um, the Witcher, Lord of the Rings would be cool. King Arthur and the Knights of the Round Table. World of Warcraft or Diablo. <laughs> That's not happening with Blizzard. I'm actually sort of surprised Blizzard hasn't cloned this yet. They've already shown the ability to turn evil with microtransaction games. Yeah, that's true. Nobody expects the Spanish Inquisition or a Monty Python crossover. <laughs> Tis but a scratch. Revive on death. You know what would be cool? X-Men. Imagine Wolverine or Magneto. Since they went back to the 90s for Xena and COD had them recently, he-Man, Skeletor, etc. would fit the aesthetic of the game and appeal to the older player base. Lord of the Rings, Driss Duorden, Taylor Swift, and I don't mean, I don't want a Taylor Swift unit, but the Reddit backlash drama would be worth it. What? Ast Artorius, the Abyss Walker. The next faction is supposedly some sort of Magi faction. I have a strong feeling that if they did a crossover, it would be somebody who would fit the faction so they could make it a login champion or a fusion or an event dungeon, perhaps. With that said, Merlin. He would fit perfectly into the game. Yeah, I like it. Although it wouldn't technically cross over, more of a mythology reference, so fuck it. Dumbledore! <laughs> Dumbledore! I mean, I don't love the idea of Harry Potter in Raid personally, but I think it would bring in a decent amount of players. The HP crowd is very far reaching. That's true. I don't think it would fit either, but I agree there would definitely be some new players if they did that. Special mythical with no ability to transform. Form 1, Arnold Schwarzenegger. Let off some steam, strikes an enemy twice, 50% chance of defense down, based on enemy max HP, it's turbo time, AoE, speed down, speed up, ally attack, 4 turn cooldown, get to the choppa, applies ally protect, strengthen, increase defense, block buffs, passive, I'll be back, instantly revives on death in secondary form with 50% HP, 
Grant's boost. Like, this is pretty cool. Form 2, T800. That's a damn minigun. AoE four times. <laughs> Applies poisons. Increased turn meter by 5% for each poison applied. It's basically like another turn. I need your clothes, boots, and motor uh, motorcycles. AoE steals their turn meter. Ignores 50% of enemy defense. Steals buffs from a random enemy. Buff steal. Ignores 50% of resistance. Terminated. AoE ignoring all damage reduction effects. Including stone skin. Damage increases per buff. Enemies can't be killed or revived. Hasta la vista, baby. Upon death, applies a two-turn bomb debuff to each enemy. Ignores 50% of enemy resistance. Cannot be revived by any means after death. That is crazy. That's a crazy kit. Holy shit, I feel like you've saved this one for a while. That's a badass idea. I like that. This is a really good idea. Imagine if they brought Arnold Schwarzenegger to raid. Raid and Halo, Master Chief would be great. Alucard from Castlevania, Mortal Kombat, Anakin Skywalker, Darth Vader, Guts, Berserker, Alucard, basically Dracula spent back, spelled backwards for anybody who doesn't know, uh, Helsing, Family Guy, what? Jujutsu Kaisen, Kimetsu no Yaiba, oh wait, that's me. I'm reading my own comment. Uh, Dwayne The Rock Johnson, John Cena, Disney, Jesus Christ, uh, especially Jesus, man, if they brought Jesus Christ to Raid, they wouldn't do it. Raid, JJK, Jujutsu Kaisen, Kratos, but yeah, there'd be too many weapons and magic to choose from. And Kratos would be so OP, he would make everybody die. Like, he would just kill everybody. The one that made your money disappear and went to jail, I think Epic Char. BNA, brand new animal from Studio Tiger. I think Raid should keep its late medieval aesthetic. Nothing to sci-fi unless it's an entire new faction with their own lore. I think adding champions based on mythologies isn't jarring. As for some games, Dark Souls would work as a crossover in my opinion. I agree. Mech Faction, give me Optimus Prime. Little Bo Beep, some Final Fantasy, Square Enix, Cloud and Sephiroth would go ham. Warhammer 40k, Alien Sci-Fi Faction. The issue with this, even though it would be cool, is that I don't think it's going to fit Raid at all. I don't think Aliens coming to Raid would fit. Mark Zuckerberg in the Lizardman Faction, Doom Guy, Warframe, Path of Exile, Doctor Fate from DC, the DC Universe would be pretty cool, Final Fantasy, uh, Lightning, dude, Lightning. Hey, Lightning? Lightning was my... You know what I mean? I love my wife, but lightning, you know? Monster Hunter again, that was a dream. Yeah, I really like that one. Killer Instinct, I'm not a fan. Mythologies have been mentioned. Can you imagine Zeus or Horus? Horus, Expendables, Thundercats, King Kong, Godzilla, One Piece, Tupac and Biggie, what? The NFL, NBA, NBA, ACDC, WWE, Mike Tyson, Lord of the Rings, and Taylor Swift, Riddick or Chuck Norris. I'm fine with any crossover event, as long as it's free. No IP, so you can always pull all the champions. GTA. Who's getting all these downvotes? This, this is somebody's been downvoting all these people. GTA characters, Berserker characters, Star Wars, Chuck Norris, and someone from Dragon Ball. I also asked you guys in my own community post on YouTube. Somebody said JJK, Gojo would be a void Lego. I was like, hey, he should be a mythical champion. Tremors, Terminator, Star Wars, dinosaurs, that would be cool. Tom and Jerry, that'd be funny, but it wouldn't fit. Demon Slayer, yeah, Demon Slayer would be huge. I would love pirates. We have our mons, we need more. Hey, Captain Jack Sparrow, I've been saying, ever since ever since our mons was announced and came out, I was like, hey, pirate, he looks like a pirate. The Fate series and Gilgamesh, God of War and Raid. Tickle says Overlord collab. Yes. Paying over, paying for trips, diamonds on a neck, diamonds on a 